We got a little shrimp here, some butter bullets. Holy cow, look at all these. These are great. Whew, listen to that. All right, try to carefully excavate these from the ground. Oh yeah, okay. Whew. What a nice little family. All right, trim the bottoms off. I wanted to show you how to find a butter bolete. What you're looking for is these kind of shrumps, little pushed up bits of ground. This one's actually fairly easy to see because there were some sticks on top that, uh, that really made it stick out. And you know what? It's a cluster of four huge mushrooms. So pretty excited to unearth this. Whenever I come to a shrump, I'm extra aware that I am disturbing an organism's fruiting body. And I'm not worried about picking the mushrooms because this is sort of like the flower or the fruit. So it won't do any long-term damage to the mycelium below if I pick the mushroom. But what I do want to do is to very carefully remove it from the ground so to not disturb the mycelium. Some people really like to cut. I don't think it makes that big a difference whether you cut or pluck. I think the biggest thing is that when you remove it, do it really carefully. Hey guys, found a shrimp here. I think there might be some butter bullets underneath it. Whew. Listen to that slap. These out carefully. Oh, yeah, good ones. Woo. A little shimmy shake here. Get the dirt off. And we're gonna cut these this bottom part off and put it back in the soil and cover it back up again so we don't disturb the mycelium of this mushroom. But wow, look at this. Down there, cover up, and clean these off. <laughs> 